Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. The Jal and the Return of the Jesus. The Descent of Isa alayhi salatu wa salam. Before discussing about the descension of Isa ibn Maryam, may Allah be pleased with them both. It will be more appropriate. It will, it will be more appropriate, firstly, to be familiar with his description, as occurs in the legislative text. The description of Isa, may Allah's uh, peace and uh, blessing be upon him, is description as occurs in the narration is that he is a man, medium height, not tall or short, reddish in complexion, curly, curly hair. Broad chest, straight forward as if he has come out after bathing, washing from a bedroom, combed exceeding his uh, earlobes, falling out between his shoulders. The hadith read them are the following. What is reported by both Bukhari and Muslim from Abu Raira, may Allah be pleased with him, who said, Allah wasalam, said, I met Musa on the, on the night of my ascension. And I met Isa describing him, saying he was one of moderate height, red faced. At first, as he had just come out from a bedroom, Bukhari too narrated from Ibn Abbas, may Allah be with them, both of them who said, may Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, I saw Isa, Musa and Ibrahim, as for Isa, then he is a rudish, complexion, curly haired and broad chested. While Muslim read from Abu Huraira, may Allah be pleased with him, who said, Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, I found myself in Al-Hijr and the Quraysh who were asking about my night journey. I saw Isa ibn Maryam praying the closest of all of men in resemblance is Urwa ibn Mas'ud al-Taqafi. Father in Bukhari the Muslim is reported from Abdullah ibn Umar may Allah be pleased with them both who said the message of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa said I found myself one night near the Kaaba I saw a man with brunette completion amongst the fairest uh, completion men to ever saw. He had a limb of a fair the most beautiful of uh, limam that you ever saw combed with some what with water drinking out from him from from it he was leaning on two men on or on, in the shoulders of two men and he was he was uh, completing around the kaaba i asked with this he to say this is isa bin maryam and in bukhari and muslim version from uh, ibn umar may allah be pleased with them both is it is mentioned no by Allah. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam did not say that. He said it's a, it's a rudish in completion. But rather he said, then he, he, he then mentioned the complete uh, hadith similar to previous narration. Moreover, the Muslim narration from Ibn Umar, may Allah please with, please with them both. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, There was a man with the Adam completion who said was neither too kind nor too straight. To harmonize between these narrations, that in some he is, is, is a rudish in completion, in some that is Adam in completion, and that he is straight haired. And some of some, some his hair is curly, then there is no consistency between redness and brownness. Uh, for it is uh, admissible that his brownness is clear brownness. As for Ibn Umar, may Allah be with them both, the denial of the report that Isa is, is, is rudish in, in completion, then he is at variance with those who have also memorized the color of his completion. Since both Abu Raira, may Allah be with them, and Ibn Abbas, may Allah be pleased with, with, be, be with both of them. I have narrated that, uh, that he, may Allah's, may Allah's praise and be, uh, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, is a rudish completion. And as for him being straight haired in one narration, curly haired in another, in another and curly haired in opposite uh, to being straight, uh, straight haired, then to reconcile between these two differences that he is actually straight haired. As for him being described as curly haired, then the intent behind that is the curliness in his bloody, bloody hair, uh, bodily hair. Which is due to combination of the flesh and its, its, its firmness, and not the hair of his head.